Hello everyone, I am back with some more Terraria. I'm torturing myself. <laughs> I am totally torturing myself because I'm doing two series at once. My Minecraft stuff and my Terraria stuff. I am planning on making my channel 100% Minecraft and Terraria and the occasional Call of Duty. In the occasional random other game. Roscoe, what are you doing? Get my dog, Roscoe. He's just, um, sitting here. He's gonna be gone probably in two days because he has to leave and go back to his other house. Let's see, cut that out of video. Yeah. Spoilers for 1.14, by the way. You all should all see the video right now or skip a little bit. There's gonna be a new boss. Okay. I wish there was a way to back up my chair a little bit more. I'm way too close to the TV and it's kind of annoying. I can't use the Undertaker because it's not a mage item. So I'm gonna sell it. <laughs> I was using the spear a lot last episode. But the only reason why. Because my mage weapon kind of sucks balls. <laughs> so I can't. I've had to. I'm gonna keep this strange plant. I'm gonna continue working on the house, but I'm probably gonna cut all that out. So let me just check something. Please tell me I can make a new axe. I'm triggered. Really freaking triggered. Make some cactus armor real quick. see what I can't make. Cactus pickaxe, why not? I can use, to, I can, cactus pickaxe is no different from this pickaxe, really. Okay, you are all going to see me and... Well, I'm, I'm gonna go work on the house. And, uh... Yeah. <laughs> and that's the house done. I just... I spent like... 10, 15 minutes working on that. Okay. I don't know why. I just love the way houses look in Terraria. When you're looking at it like this, if it's humongous, it's pretty satisfying to look at. But from the map, especially when it's about that tall and like that big, there are some mansions that have been built in Terraria. I once built a house in Terraria that was like from here to here all the way to over here it was so gigantic and it took me way too long there were no trees on that world and i had to go into another world and get more trees because it took forever i spent an entire playthrough working on that house way too long okay so i i got an arms dealer now he just appeared out of freaking nowhere let me assign these houses I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven houses. I have one, I have four people. Three are currently vacant. Guides and all of there. Honk you. If, so I have three that can just be used anytime. So, <laughs> can't wait to get those filled up. I'm just gonna get away from the house, the arms dealer will just teleport in. Do I have bombs on Kremier actually could kill me because they're so annoying and they have like no knockback. <laughs> I have a die traitor. Thank you, Lord Jesus. I'm really hoping my dies suck because I want gold. Hello, mister. Akbar. Did I just get freaking negative die? <laughs> I just got negative die. I got my two favorite dies, blue acid and negative. <laughs> I got so lucky. It's my favorite dies, my dude. Everyone loves negative. Straight up. Negative is really popular. I love blue acid quite a bit. 
Oh wow, that's so tedious. No, I did not mean to trash it. Let's see, which is better? I'm using blue acid. My two favorite dyes. Keeping the negative. Kinda. How much do they sell for again? Yeah, okay. I'm keeping it. I'm just gonna put it in my pick bank. I'm gonna sell a bunch of my useless bull crap to this guy. I'm going to be unbelievably mad, okay? I'm going to be so freaking mad if the meteorite's right here. Are you kidding me? I don't have anything that can mine it, I think. Come on, there's no way my cactus pickaxe can mine that. I knew it. A bomb can break it. No, it can't. <laughs> my pickaxe. Memes, I love them. Holy! I hate my life, 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 I hate my life. Frick, 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 frick. I just want to get to my dungeon, bruh. Please, bruh. No, I might just go mining. Till I get bombs. I know I can get bombs from mining. It's, it's a way easier thing to do. You get bombs from breaking pots and mining. That's like really the only way to get bombs until you finally get a demolitionist. And it's really annoying. Once I get bombs, I'll be all over that meteorite back here. I, I'm pretty sure it's like 400 meteor. And I'm pretty sure all that meteor is worth like. I teleported home instantly. Oh, hello, mister. Oh, wow. Just... Oh, hello, mister. Huh? Hello. I'm um, half five dynamite. That's plenty. That's freaking plenty. I can get a lot of meteor for that. Oh, my God. It's going to take forever to get there. Okay, guys, I am finally at the meteorite. This took way too long. I cannot believe it. It, it just it just had to spawn all the way over here. It just had to. Of course it did. So, um, guys, just something I'm going to tell you. I really don't need to go mining anymore. Honestly, I don't. You know why I really don't have to go mining, like, at all anymore? Until I enter, like, the very end of pre-hard mode and I have to go to the underworld and stuff. Here's why. Once I mine up this meteorite, I'll have great weapons, great armor, the second best armor in freaking pre-hard mode, so, and I won't have to go mining anymore because I don't have to get any better armor, and then I can just kill the eye Cthulhu and the brain of Cthulhu, get myself freaking better items and everything for mining and then I can go in the underworld and that's the only other time I have to mine so I can get molten armor and I'm gonna try not to even get molten armor oh crap oh no oh no are you kidding me I fell babies i don't care wipe out my magic mirror make sure it's everything it's everything let's get the frick out of here 282 i swear if i need the better forge if i need it thank you i don't so space gun i have that oh my god that was very expensive 10 that's 30 it's 45 meteor just to craft a set okay it's l2 to quick craft i can't believe it's that expensive 
Okay, now I actually have a pretty good amount of defense. Costs zero mana. I don't need mana potions. <laughs> I might make the hammax. <sighs> don't know. I should. I mean, X power is pretty good. I'm making it. Let's sell a bunch of crap I don't need. Like my meteor bars, my spear, I don't need that anymore. Don't need that, don't need that. Don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need that. Oh, that. Oh, that. Honestly, that's a real- I can use this as a weapon. Oh my god, it's pretty powerful. So I don't know. When I get a goblin tinker, should I go all men menacing? That's 20% extra damage on something that's only 25 damage. It's not that much. If I had a weapon that did 150 damage, 20% extra damage would actually be pretty good. That's like 30, 40 something. But 20% extra damage only set this up at like 31. All menacing mixed with though with like the freaking all menacing mixed with um I don't really know <laughs> what is it all menacing mixed with the highest damaging weapon in pre hard mode whatever is actually pretty good okay I have a ham axe and I can mine stuff pretty well. I have 21 defense. I'm fighting Mr. Eye of Cthulhu tonight. I'm gonna need a pretty big bridge. Why am I going this way? Let's just magic mirror. It saves time. I should be able to kill him pretty quickly because this space gun cost me zero mana to shoot. I am so happy about that. Okay, so it's about two and a half shots a second. Yeah, it's about. So, around 56, so around 50 to 55 something damage a second. That's pretty good. I mean, if I went all menacing, it would be like 80 to 90 damage a second, but I ain't doing that. Oh, that's such a better difference. No one makes axes. No one makes axes, like, ever. Like, once you make an axe, I can mine a tree and, like, literally one second you never need to make any other axes again and that's usually honestly I don't need any more axes I I don't care I'm not making any other axes anymore this meteor axe is fast enough anything that can break trees this quickly is your last axe you'll ever need to make because like it's so fast So what I'm going to do is because I need a, just because like once I get to, hopefully once I get to the hard mode and I have to take on the, you know, mechanical bosses. With mechanical bosses, I'm telling you, quick tip, very quick tip. Build, especially for Destroyer, build a humongous freaking platform, a like platform that stretches out 200 on one side on, on uh, down of 200 and then 200 on top of it just so you can do stuff it's almost nighttime it's a pretty decently sized one I'm gonna fight him twice Get my iron skin potion don't even need it but who cares 29 defense that could be 49 so happy I don't have to use any mana potions, my guy. I literally just need to do this the entire time and I can easily survive. Look at his health, it's already pretty low. He only does one damage to me? <laughs> okay. My god, I completely underestimated how great the space gun is. Well, space gun and meteor armor is like the be is one of the best freaking combos in all of pre hard mode. So 
No, I'm going to try really hard not to destroy him. Are you kidding me? Are you freaking- I just fell down here. I'm gonna try really hard not to do any more damage to him because I want to start shooting at him. Okay, here we go. I want to start shooting at him. This is like the best time to shoot at him while he's spinning. You get to do like 200 to 300 for just free damage. That was- this is a pretty fast battle, my dude. Weak. And he is dead! I'll take that. And I'll fight him again. He literally does quite literally nothing to me. This is too easy, I love it. Wait, doesn't this thing have pierce? Oh, this this space gun has pierce on it, okay. Oh my god, my demolitionist, he uses grenades. <laughs> <laughs> because he uses grenades, he does like a bullcrapish amount of damage. <laughs> That's hilarious. H2O delirious, I'm sorry. Okay, um, I have a lot of stuff now. 100. 101 cream tain? Say okay. It's like nothing. It's like nothing. Only 33? Are you kidding me? I can't create any armor. I'm not even gonna bother making the sword. Um, I'm gonna save my stuff. Let me get back to work on the platform. Okay, I will fight the Brain of Cthulhu, Cthulhu, the Brain of Cthulhu today. But I'm going to cut like 30 to 40 minutes of footage, like any minute now. Any minute now, I'm just gonna stop doing everything and just cut out. 20 to 40 minutes of footage of me just doing a bunch of bull crap. But trust me, I will fight the Brain of Cthulhu. I'm just making this longer. You know what? Let's try it. Let's try this. Oh, wait. No, I can't. Okay, never mind. I won't fight the Brain of Cthulhu today. Looks like I can't. It's gonna take way too. It's gonna take me like 3 minutes to summon him. Because I don't have any summoners for him. So, can't. And the night's gonna end any minute now, so I guess this is the end of the video. Um, I I'm not planning really on doing anything with Crimtain at all, other than pretty much just sell it. Um, I'll do that. That I don't need any more silver. I don't need that gold. I don't need that ten. Don't need that. Thirteen gold worth of Crimtain. Okay. Well, no, I have a lot of gold. I have exactly 37. I don't feel like it, so let's do this. Now I have 37. Exactly. So I guess this is the end of the video. So, uh, see ya. This will be up uh, pretty much like three or four hours after I'm recording the video because it's gonna be gruesome and torture to edit this thing because it's such a long video so see ya um, tomorrow I will be fighting the Brain of Cthulhu and then I will fight hopefully another boss and probably three to four episodes I will make a giant bridge in the underworld and then one more episode after that I might fight the wall of flesh there's one very annoying bug about the wall of flesh, and it's where you throw the voodoo doll in, and it does nothing. You can have a guide, and literally this happened to me once. I threw my guide voodoo doll in, my guide died with the wall of flesh for some reason, didn't summon, I'm like, what? It's a really annoying bug, and it happens to me way too often, it's so annoying. So, uh, see ya.